Hey Rad Reelers, JC here with Rad Reeling Fishing. Well you guys, check it out. Big ol' big ol' it's a gator freaking snatch hook, yeah. <laughs> hey listen, my plan is to throw into some of these big schools of mullet today. I'm gonna fish them with a spoon first, see if they can't pull some redfish out of them. And then after we do that, <laughs> we're gonna hook up the old snatch hook. I got my big rod, 50 pound test, nice stiff rod, got 80 pound test leader. We're going to see if we can't snatch some of these big old fat mullets. So anyway, we're going to have fun today. I'll probably get on some trout too. But yeah, let's see how we do, man. Got a, got a good tide running until about noon. I think it's about 9 o'clock. So let's, let's get on it. I can't believe I forgot my dang pocket knife today. Oh, what's up with that? All right. Yeah, that ought to get them right there, man. Big old snatch hook. Snatch them up. Snatch them up, JC. Come on, Mr. Redfish. I see some ripples over there. Oh, nice cast, dude. Forgot my uh, sunglasses today. Dang it. Oh, I got a freaking fish. Are you kidding me? I thought I was hung up on something. I got a big stingray. I thought I was hung on the bottom. What? Are you kidding? What the heck, dude? Well, that's weird. That is so weird. He got a little short tail. I thought I was hung on the bottom. <laughs> I don't like messing with these things at all. See you, buddy. Well, he's trying to flip over. Stingray on a Johnson spoon. Woo! up with that need to find those big schools of mullet go ahead and give this guy right here a shot see if we can't find some trout ladyfish or something can't get any any action on the paddle tail this morning what's up with that all right where did i put that terrorize there he is mr terrorize see if we can't get us a trouty trouty on the terrorize this morning need to catch something here super glued the tail on my terrorize I caught so many fish on it last time, the tail got torn. Hopefully it'll hold up. Fish on, oh, 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 fish. That was definitely a fish right there. All right, anchor down, JC. We had a bite. We had us a bite. Oh, 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 he took my darn tail. Look at that, he took my tail. Doggone. Doggone it. All right, well, let's see if we can just talk them into it without a tail. Maybe they'll think it's a tailless freaking fish. All right. There he is. Look at that. Getting them on a freaking terrorize without a tail, baby. Woo! All right. We got us something. We got us something. Oh, baby, we got a lizard fish. All right, let's do a lizard fish freaking lizard fish catch and cook baby that's what i'm talking about lizard fish catch and cook that doa terrorize that's what he hit man <laughs> Woo. let's see if we got another one out there we might just be in lizard fish freaking territory do 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 come on fishy fishy had two hits ba boom ba boom boom now i can't get a bite just a twitching just a twitching i haven't any confidence in this bait now so we got to do a little switching up baby a little switching up all right guys put on a little doa shrimp here a little doa shrimp see if i can get them on that oh yeah jerky jerky's the way to go man get you a dehydrator i put a link in the description area to the dehydrator that i use I like to dehydrate chicken breasts. Really, really good. Look at the color of that. Mmm. Little teriyaki sauce with some garlic, salt, and pepper. That's that's a ticket right there. Good stuff, man. Well, fishing sucks, but the eating <laughs> the eating's good, right? Friggin' boring video. 
We need some action, man. Here's something. Here we go. Here we go. Get the mirror game. Be a red fish. Oh yeah, here we go. Fish on. Nice little surprise fish here. What do we got? Yeah, maybe we don't have a red fish. Oh, look at that. We got us a freaking sheep's head. What? He went for the Meridine too. He got that thing in his mouth. In his mouth. I thought I had a red fish. I never would have freaking believed it. You believe it? All right, guys. Well, I had to take a look and make sure that the uh, the size limit was still 12 inches. I know they were going to change it on sheep's head, but there's no doubt about it. This guy right here is 12, and uh, he was hungry for a Meridine, so we're going to keep this guy. Put him in there with our lizard fish. Yeah, baby. Woo. Whoop. Watch them toes. This must be some hungry sheep's head around here, man. Woo. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Surprise, surprise. Absolutely crazy. A sheep's head on a Meridine? What? Any of you guys ever catch a sheep's head on a Meridine? I thought they liked shrimp and crabs. Maybe he thought it was a, a crab. He definitely had a hook in his mouth, y'all. That was not a snag. He was going for the Meridine. I thought I had a red fish. And then when he came up, I'm like, wait a minute. I was thinking it was a black drum. Heck yeah, I'll take a sheep's head. Woo, all right. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Oh, good hit, man. Good hit. Wow, he freaking wanted that thing. Whoa, surprise, freaking surprise. Man, he surprised me. Whoa, I was not expected that dude. He freaking hammered it, man. Whoo, gotta be a redfish the way he took off running. Gotta be a red. Oh, yeah. Oh, he hammered that freaking thing, man. Wow. I was looking over there in that little cut, and I'm thinking, I ought to go over there and do some casting this freaking dude come out there little snook thought i had a red come out there and freaking hammered that meridine dang fishing's freaking turning on a sheep's head a sheep's head and a snook what the heck all right a little oh man heck yeah Woo! no complaints here oh hungry little guy man thanks for the catch buddy see ya Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> In the middle of the freaking day, man. I don't even know what time it is. What time is it? 11.40, man. <laughs> Catching snook in the middle of the day on a Meridane. Nice. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right. Let's see if we can get another one. You're all excited, man. I caught me a little snooky and a sheep's head. Oh, there's a fish right there. He comes shooting out and grabbed it. Looked like a little snapper. Look at that. We get the multi-species day going on today. Stingrays. Got us a little mang. Oh, 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 oh. Got us a little hungry mangrove on the Meridine. Nice. Wouldn't expect to catch a mangrove on a Meridine either. Thanks, buddy. Woo! some mullets up in there I need to find us a big old school of mullet man that might be the school i'm looking for right there i can get that treble hook up in there we're gonna do a little snatching we're gonna try it we got some activity up here this might be the this might be my mullet school you guys let's see what happens with the old snatch snatch hook arena seems like there's quite a few of them seeing some ripples on top of the water They'll never know what hit them. Never know what hit them. There he is. Oh, got me a bottom fish. 
We need big freaking schools of mullet, not just a couple here and there. We need one of those schools that's got like 300 of them in it. Could have tied my leader shorter. I need to do that right now. I reeled my swivel right up inside of my, my rod. I'm glad I bring extra knives. I need to figure out a way to mount this thing somewhere. We need a big school, man. We, we need to find a big school. See, there's just two or three of them in there. Back to the mirror, Dean. Deeny, Deeny, Mary. Mirror Dean. So this is the corner where I was cast netting the mullet that one day. Cove right over here. I had some definite hits in it this morning. I'm gonna head over there and see if we can't can't get on something. Fish on. Here we go. Here we go. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, baby. Nice, nice, nice. What do we got? What do we got? I saw yellow. Another little snook. Another little snooky. Yeah. Turned out to be a pretty darn good freaking day of fishing, man. Yeah. All right. Got him a mouth full of Meridine. We got some getter offers right here. There we go. Nice little snook. Hee hee. Thanks for the catch. Woo! Catching the mangrove snapper. The snook and the sheep's head on the Meridane. Getting them on the Meridane. Fishy, doesn't it? Yeah. Looks really fishy, man. Ah. I should drop my anchor pole right here. Fish this whole little cove right here with the Meridane. The wind's blowing in that direction. Fish should be laying right up there against the mangroves, waiting for the bait to get pushed to them. There is no current, but there is wind. I'm getting heartburn from my jerky. to get it in that little cove right there. Nice cast, bud. There he is. Good fish, good fish. Nice snook, nice snook. Man, I'm glad I anchored up right there. What did I tell you? They should be hanging right there, waiting for the bait to come to them. This is a good fish now. Heck yeah. I'm taking it. I am taking it in the middle of the afternoon. Woo! Putting on a freaking show for JC's viewers. All the rad reeling audience. Enjoying all that fish jumping. Woo! He's going behind the kayak. Whoa! Uh-oh. He's going under the kayak. I haven't seen how good he's hooked. I hope he doesn't come off. He's trying to go under the kayak. Come on, dude. Get out of there. Nice snook. Yeah, he, he just inhaled that Meridine. Oh my goodness, he inhaled that freaking thing. Boy was hungry. Alright, well we gotta do a gotta do a little snook surgery here. You gotta let him go pretty quick here, guys. Nice, nice snook. Yeah, he's he's bleeding. He got it in the gills. Alright. Thanks for the catch, buddy. Get out of here. Go on and heal up. Woo! Turn them up. Oh man, I hate it. That guy, he got, he had one hook down deep, got him in one of the gills. I was able to get it out without tearing him up, but he was bleeding. Oh well, but the wind is blowing in that direction and I just anchored up figuring, you know, fish like to wait for the bait to get pushed to them in the wind or the tide well there's no current here so i figured maybe there'd be something laying up here along this edge hey son of a gun <laughs> got another one man Woo! that's the the meridian i'm throwing right there that little bitty guy i don't know we got three snook on that thing now mangrove snapper and a sheep's head i need to get retied tie this guy on with a loop knot so he can have a little extra action 
I'm excited, man. Woo! Hey, we got us a rockfish. Dang, you sound like an alligator. Oh man, what a freaking cast. Right on the edge of the mangroves. Whenever you get out and you're fishing, I, I really think it's just important when you're just pounding it and pounding it and pounding it, you're not catching fish. Just breathe. Take a break. Eat you an apple. Get you some popcorn, some beef jerky, whatever. <laughs> get you something to drink. Check your phone. Just find a nice little shady spot, man. I'm hanging out right here. I'm just hanging out right here along the mangroves. Little shady area right here. I'm going to eat me an apple. We're going to get back on it. I was supposed to be looking for the mullet a long time ago. And I uh, still haven't come across the big school. But I need to go over there where I think they're probably at. And uh, kind of heading that way. But I got distracted by catching snook. <sighs> Dang. Having a good time. Mm. I love this time of year. I think it's apple season, right? Maybe apple season just passed. I don't know. These apples are freaking delicious right now. Well guys, I'm fishing out of my Old Town Predator PDL kayak today, and I sure am having a good time. I have not fished that mangrove edge right there. Before I do, I'm going to go in here because this is the spot where the mullets like to hang out. See if we got some mullets hanging out up in there. This is where I cast netted on that giant school of mullet and missed them just by 10 feet. Maybe you got to come here on a low tide in the middle of the day. It was low tide at daylight today. All right. Well, I don't see any mullet. Let's go back and fish that mangrove edge. Dang it. I want to catch a freaking mullet with this hook. Well, something's chasing them right there in front of me. What the heck? Chasing a school of mullets. Oh, oh, there he is. There he is. Fish on. <laughs> fish on they were just chasing the mullet what did i find lady fish barracuda multi-species multi-species on the meridine <laughs> ah these guys are cute stinky but cute all right thanks for the catch mr Ooh, barracuda gave himself away man his finger mullet were just flying across the top of the water I'm like oh something's after those things little barracuda whoa just ran up on another bar this is probably where all the reds are at There we go. There we go. Nice, baby. Nice. Nice. I'm glad I cast it up in there. Nice little snooky. Snooky. All right. Got the little snookster. Got another one in the middle of the day, man. All right. Miradine doing it up. Doing it up. This little guy. Hit it. Same scenario as before, the wind direction. Mm -mm. I think I had a hook break. I did have a hook. Whoa! A hook break. Did he get it stuck in there? No? Huh. Alright. Nice little snooky. Thanks for the catch, buddy. Hey, hey, 
beautiful fish, man. See ya. Yes. Man, these little snook are just hammering this Meridine. Hard, hard, hard. I'm fishing with my Pen Pursuit 3 4000 reel on my ugly stick GX2 six foot six medium action today. I'll put a link in the description area, you guys, to the rod and reel that I'm using. I use a reasonably priced braid. This is 15 pound test. I've got it rigged up with 25 pound test, reasonably priced monofilament leader. And uh, of course we're fishing with a Meridine lure that uh, ah, they're reasonably priced. <laughs> Not outrageous. I fished with more expensive lures before. All right, don't get hung up in the mangroves, JC. Oh, watch out for them fishing rods. Swing it hard, dude. There you go.